I am Stephanie Hoff representing Dane County Farm Bureau and the Midwest Farm Report as a farm broadcaster. I was nominated for the sustainability storytelling category and I'm standing in front of you today to say that I can't define sustainability but you can. Our farmers, I ask you all the time in interviews, how do you define sustainability? And through the conversations I've had, I've heard it comes down to three things, the environment, the community, and your pocketbook. Economic, environmental, and social sustainability all work together, and you can't have one without the others. For example, a dairy farmer in southeastern Wisconsin planted 1,200 trees earlier this spring. It takes carbon out of the atmosphere, that's environmental sustainability, it keeps his uh, grazing dairy cattle under some shade during those hot summer months to keep milk production up. That's economic sustainability. And it took a community and many partnerships to get the funds and labor to plant those trees. Another example I have for you is actually the first time I ever went to a cranberry bog. I was with Wisconsin Farm Bureau during their sustainability series tour. And I learned that cranberry growers recycle water and maintain a wildlife habitat. That's environmental sustainability. They also bring in uh, tourism dollars into the community, uh, the social sustainability, and they made a return on those investments, economic sustainability. That's a really just a sliver of some of the examples I can share with you about the sustainability stories I share with Midwest Farm Report on the radio network, on our website, newsletter, and social media channels. We reach more than 73,000 farms, and I'm proud to say we're the number one choice for nearly 1.4 million dairy cows. Now, my goal with Midwest Farm Report is actually to grow that audience, specifically the younger generations. Unfortunately, with each generation, we know that we become more far removed from where our food comes from, and I wanna help bridge that gap. I do it in a few different ways. First, getting in front of my audience going to those county fairs, talking with the kiddos in the show ring about their animal, going to dairy breakfast, helping to MC an ice cream eating contest, or even helping out with the Dane County Dairy Promotion Board on educating Girl Scouts on agriculture to help them earn their dairy patch. The other way I wanna reach this goal is through working on unique projects with our clients, helping agribusinesses tell their unique story through not only our traditional mediums, but also through podcasts and video. Now we have a team to measure success if you're looking at downloads, clicks, or social media engagement. But I like those anecdotal responses. The teenager at the Juneau County Fair who says she listens to me in the morning while she's helping milk cows. Or the mom and dad that pull me aside and say, hey, our daughters listen to you on the farm they want to be like you and have a job in farm broadcasting or egg communications. That's what gets me up in the morning to tell the story of agriculture. That's why I want to share our agribusiness's story with our audience, which is becoming more and more consumer based and tell them about that positive message of economic, social and environmental sustainability of Wisconsin agriculture.